Yo, what's going on to all of my warriors on YouTube? This is, of course, Mark checking in once again. Coming at you guys with another video. First things first, I <coughs> excuse me. Hope you guys are having a blessed day. I'm feeling good myself. Tonight is actually Halloween night. So if it's Halloween where you guys are at in the U.S., I think I got a lot of U.S. followers um i don't really celebrate halloween but if you do happy halloween and stay safe out there but i just thought i'd update you guys on my semen uh, retention journey today i got hit with a freaking temptation bro you know i'll be honest like i went to a massage parlor right i'll be honest i went to a massage parlor and i even told the lady like i only want a massage i know i know that she has more to offer, but I didn't want to do that because, you know, I'm staying disciplined, right? And <coughs> and I'm, I'm going to be honest with you guys. You know, she was feeling on me, right? She was, like, touching me. And, uh, like, bro, I almost fell into that. I ain't going to lie. I almost fell into that. But, you know, I, I reminded myself, like, bro, just, you know, no PMO. And most of all, you're not you're not releasing right um and you know really doing your best to abstain from sex because what i realize is bro um <coughs> excuse me like after a while man you're gonna feel drained bro um and there's definitely a balance to life and to everything you never want to go too extreme to one side of the polarity right like what i mean is and i was speaking with my dad about this today right we were talking about work and learning when to take time away from work so if i'm bringing it in terms of semen retention like you never want to go too much to the point where you're not i guess uh you're kind of just staying away from females i guess you know what I mean? Like, I think you should be speaking to females. I think you should be... Um, actually, that's up to you, bro. <laughs> I'm not going to... You know what I mean? I never want to tell you guys what to do. But, you know, that, like what I'm saying is just keep a balance to everything. Right? <clears throat> I still believe... And I'm, I'm not perfect, guys. But I'm not perfect. But I still believe in, you know like sex before marriage and you know following the laws in the bible bro i ain't gonna lie i haven't read my bible ever, ever since i've been moving around but i still keep the i still do my best to keep the laws in my heart bro but you know what i mean i know eventually i'll get back to it too right so just um keeping a balance man and how do you know that you're keeping a balance is really about um if you feel like you're on one side too much, just take some time out and recenter yourself. And you do that through, you know, just focusing on yourself. Um, also with me, you know, I'm in a room sometimes or I'm in environment where I'm, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> I can't talk, bro. But, you know, I'm in, in in an environment where I'm surrounded with people or, you know, I got to constantly communicate. So that means I got to take time out for myself. That means there's times where I need to recharge. Right. Like not trying to sound like a, like I'm pushing people away, but sometimes I just don't want to be around people like that and I need to recharge, you know. So maybe some of you guys are, you know struggling bro just find the balance bro and it's it's great when you actually like um you are talking to a real female right you're not watching websites um you know and it's good if you and the female you guys get along you 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 know what i mean you find you find good uh balance within each other right i'll be honest with you guys like i'm talking to this one female right now here I met a lady friend here. I'm, I've been meeting a lot of people, not just ladies, but, you know, she's real cool. 
and uh it's one of those things where only time will tell right so i don't have no expectations because i think also when you have certain or specific ex expectations it kind of leads to disappointment it's not bad to um have a goal or whatever right or you know you have a dream right right you have not really an expectation but i think more so standards for yourself you know um what sort of standards you have what's your dreams i think that's different from expectations i think expectations is more so um like very specific based in a way and you know basically what i'm trying to say is only time will tell and you can prepare for it but really you got to be present man right that's really what it's about preparing but staying present So that's just some of the things that's been on my mind, guys. Um, I think I'm going to upload the uh, full video tomorrow. I got to prepare, but I was like, man, I just needed to rest today. Today's been a rest day. So, you know, once again, finding that balance, man. I've been moving around a lot. So, yeah, I'm going to take my time out, right, to vacate because I'm on vacation. So always remember, no pain, no progression. Get your reps in. Shout out to all my supporters, all my warriors once again, man. Excuse me. I know I haven't really been uploading crazy like that, but that's just because I've been, um, you know, out here in, uh, in Asia, bro, I think you really have to stay aware of your surroundings. And especially because I'm in public places. So just got to stay aware, stay, stay careful, man. All right, but you guys stay safe. Catch you on the next video. Appreciate all the love. And so I think, <coughs> excuse me, with November coming up, I think this is day one or day two. I don't know. But I'm going to do my best to to stay, stay disciplined. Do my best to keep you guys updated. Right? And, uh, you know, just keep moving forward, man. Just keep moving forward. Don't beat yourself up. Be present.